Hello everyone, my name is Drumat and today we're going to do a Talia top guide in Grandmaster on Rob Nordic and Ace and we're going to see how we play against a Rumble. Also, I noticed some UI changes from the last patch. Well, this is interesting. It looks interesting, I suppose. Okay, so we are playing Talia top. We are playing with this skin, the blue skin. I want to play with blue skin a bit with this one <laughs> the ssg and we are having electrocute chip shot eyeball collection ravenous hunter prince of mine cup the grace and these room stats i'm thinking here instead of chip shot that i should go for taste of blood we're also against a good twitch uh, needly duo both of them are grandmaster with over 60 percent win rate which probably puts them at smurfers level and we will have we have a high challenger on mid with 700 lp or so and some bot lane not remembering much about them but we gotta play against a combo that can scale on every single lane and this sucks uh, jana was afk okay uh, yeah supposedly this went nice should i i can't help you they are already they are pinging each other already so this is going great guys, this is going fantastic. Rumble playing with uh, Ring, also I'm playing with GLP and I'm going for something like uh, Rabadons because I need to one shot people, okay, it's coming, I'm going, okay, it's no longer coming. And I think I just told them by following that. <laughs> they were Vi's, okay. I thought Vi would gank, but it's better that she didn't. Alright, so we're gonna get a bit poked, and we need we need now to be sure we don't int much, and so we need to get all of this wave. I'm gonna ping that he's missing. Auto attack, auto attack, don't miss that. And get everything, okay, once he is behind. Uh, this is going to be tricky because of this Smurfer Nidalee, or theoretical Smurfer Nidalee, I don't know. Also, mid lane should pretty much win, because if he doesn't, uh, that's going to be not so nice. I'm gonna get the cannon there, I'm gonna proc, uh, I'm gonna proc the electrocute, and... They spotted that also, you don't have flash on mid. It really has teleport. For some reason she plays with teleport. Alright, we can just get away from this. Okay, dodge one, dodge two. And he can't kill me. Okay. It's fine, we're fine. He lost by this action a lot of experience, a lot of CS and now the wave is also in my favor. He lost a lot. That was a good play by him but I was prepared sort of as you can see for it and now we can just go back and we can probably get the kill he used everything so one full combo might actually help us but the good thing that he did was because of his immense push power he had time to actually push it because uh, if I was around in that context we would have done better Directly the missing of the W, and that's one of the dangers of playing Talia, to be honest. Because you can int against these players if you're not playing picture perfect, and that's bad. But what I can do here is I could position myself as such for a better gank onto the mid lane. I know that he's back, so I'm gonna ping that he's missing. I know I could go like this. Why? Because there is a river scuttle. Right. Nice. Yeah, okay. And we see them going for that. We should probably think that Rumble has no flash, so uh, we we are certain. Not we should think because. He just used it and it has the same cooldown as me. He used it when I used it, right? So, 
one advantage that we could get here it could be a proper a proper gank onto that but I would keep to be honest I would keep the ult for the bot lane if I'm losing one more cannon I swear to god I'm just gonna drop myself to diamond tree and start practicing the cannons all right okay okay that went well my client still bugged I don't know I don't understand what was with that all in I just repelled it properly and we were fine all right now we can just I will recall because even though I could probably get plates there is a lot of question marks around the map so <laughs> we just back off here because I don't feel like it I don't feel it's going great for us right now Okay, we got the Drake. Okay. We collapsed pretty nicely on them, but I was tilted. I should have flashed there, I was so tilted. Also this bug, visual bug from the... Ah, I'm not sure if it's appearing for you guys, basically I see white squares or something. Okay, I dodged that, going back to top. Okay, flashing out from the Twitch. Good. Whoa, 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 that's bad. Rumble. 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 You really start freezing, you realize doing what she should do. Oh boy. Okay. Supposedly, we did fine. Because the freaking ass went into the game. And my Rayla just hyper farms right now, which is fine. And which is very strong for her, because she will just basically carry. Which is what I wanted for this game. I wanted to enable her. That's why I ganked mid. You can see there is a 70 CS difference on mid. Also, you can also see the difference on top. But, compared to the Irelia, uh, I believe Rumble doesn't know how to play that well. Even though he killed me and he did a kill on mid. Uh, he doesn't have the same kill participation as me, even though he shouldn't. And he didn't even get the tower here. Uh, normally I'd say we are better than them uh, with the Aurelia than they are with the uh, with the Rumble. So Fed Rumble better than Fed Aurelia. Now I'm playing like this because I have this safety net. Okay, come, 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 come. Okay, Jana. Oh, okay. Uh, he, she turned back? What? Oh, she has face rush. Okay, this is good. This is good. And I got that one. But now Twitch will just hunt. So I have to stick towards the Irelia. How the hell did I miss that? From point blank, man. Alright, so we're in for a 3 versus 3. I was so slow. Okay. Wait. Good, 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 back off, back off, back off. Did our task, we got far away. Oh man, 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 get this. Good. This is a free kill. Okay. 
The only problem is that Twitch positioned himself perfectly. Can't do much more to that. Because <sighs> we focused on the wrong targets and this guy freaking surrenders, man. Alright, we have time. We have time. have even help from their vibe. Hold that hot damn that damage from Twitch. Dismantle us. Did we just int here or <laughs> not sure? Did we just int it? Cause Twitch got us. Twitch killed us before we could do anything. Get the free soul here. And now we gotta be careful. Yeah, Vi has no flash. So this can be a difficult thing to do. Okay. <laughs> Good luck, man! <laughs> I think we just win the game here. If we don't win it here, we just we just surrender. Get them. Yep. That was enough. <laughs> that was enough. Jesus, that Twitch hinted. Alright, so that was the game, guys. <laughs> and we still have the Baron buffs planned. So you can see how much we don't matter, me and this rumble. You can see how much we're irrelevant to the great scheme. All I had to do for this game was to get kills on the Irelia and play around the Vi. Nothing more. I knew I was against good players. So in order to win, go mid, get the kill on Irelia, help her. We did fine. She plays with teleport, so she's going to scale by the farm that she has. So that was the guy. Even though I haven't played perfectly, I played pretty meh at times. I should have flashed at times. I should have outplayed at times. I missed some cannons. I did in, big, in the big part of the game what was required from me. And... While I did not provide the impact of Vi and Irelia, I understood who are the impact generators and I helped them win the game from that point. Now obviously I could have probably killed the Rumble, but again I'm still not that skilled to play against the 300 LP, 200 LP OTP. Of, uh, even though I am an OTP myself, it's very difficult in top lane matchups that I'm still learning. But we did fine in pretty much this case. So this was the game, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. And see you next time. Goodbye, guys.